the lovely Camille Donatachi Grammer. Hi, Camille. Uh, hello, Andy. Congratulations on the engagement. Thank you. So happy for you. Me too. <laughs> when are you? Uh, when's the big day? Possibly October, but we're trying to figure out the logistics. Nice. Let's see the ring. Wowza. Thank you. How many carrots? I think it's around five. But it um, looks bigger. <laughs> how does that compare to your first ring? It's a little smaller. But... Kelsey's was smaller. Yes, Kelsey's. Wow. Yes. The ring? <laughs> well, yeah, what about Kelsey's? <laughs> What's wrong? <your heart? laughs> Have you talked to Kelsey at all about you getting remarried or anything? Nothing. You're not in communication? No. You know, at the end of the first season, you were on the cover of a magazine, and they called you the most hated housewife. That is correct. Here are some of the words that were used to describe you. Conniving, passive aggressive, narcissistic, insecure, fake, insincere, delusional. It's very hurtful. And now, <laughs> um, we got so many positive tweets about you. The Camille of season one is back. She deserves an award for how delicious she is. Aww. Camille didn't come to play. She came to slay. How does it feel like to go that. from abhorred to adored? It feels great. It's a lot yeah. better than being hated. Right, right. Whether it's tingling vaginas, busting a move, or busting the Machiavellics of the world, oh this original Beverly Hills Housewife makes her presence known in a big way, and she does it all with a sexy little smile. Oh, no. <laughs> Come on, let's play. Wow. It's an ice dildo. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh my God. Camille still has the same dance moves she had seven years ago in Vegas. <laughs> Woo! Hi, ladies! Camille, you're a stupid <laughs> There we go again with the C word. Dorit, everyone's entitled to act stupid once in a while, but you really abuse the privilege. So I'm going to come up with a whole new strap-on line named the Camille. Do you think she tends to talk a little too much and maybe drink too much and she just lies out of her mouth? No. Whoa. You open your mouth too much, girly. <laughs> Hopefully she'll get the message. Shut your mouth, bitch. <laughs> Don't forget this after you. Meal. <laughs> <laughs> Is that the ball gag? That's it. It's my accessory for tonight. <laughs> I never uh -huh. felt one before. What do you think? You I like it? it. It's nice. It, it goes go with your dress. Either. It goes. Yes, I thought. That's hilarious. Dorit Adam from Hempstead, New York, said the ball gag was just a cheeky little gift. Oh wait, that's what you said about the panties you gave Erica. Let's go. This is a cheeky little gift. Since we've all seen your pretty little puss now. Shut up. <laughs> I hate you. I guess you can dish it out, but you can't take it. What do you think about that? Well, it was Lisa Vanderpump's birthday party. It was an elegant. Birthday. Plus, Camille and I had moved on, so I was a little bit surprised. And this was something that I, I, uh, I can uh. take a joke. You know what? I just felt like that's a great excuse. Camille, that's genuinely how but I felt. But you felt it was okay at Kyle's to call me a I in front told of you I don't name. think it's okay. Okay, but it was a joke. I understand that, but when you asked me point blank, were you offended, are you upset about it? I said no, not at all. You didn't I seem... didn't laugh as you much as I laugh should it have. off like, oh, this is great. I got a no, ball I didn't. Oh, awesome. I didn't. I didn't. And I just explained. All the other girls Because laugh. I felt like the timing was a bit off. I'm I just, just think that's a bad excuse. Go ahead. I'm curious, Erica, excuse. what your point of view is. When Dorit was given the ball gag, your comment was, oh, you better laugh this off. Yeah, because it. it all turns. Mm -hmm. This whole experience turns on everyone. Yeah. yeah. Dish it out. You got to be able to take it. Things come out of my mouth sometimes that I wish I never said. And I need to work on that. Believe me, I like to be playful and have fun. You must have thought it or thought something, because you just don't blurt that out without thinking in the back of your head, this is how I feel about somebody. It really hurt my feelings. It humiliated me, especially in front of David. That wasn't the appropriate time. It was a bunch of things leading up to that, because a few you know, weeks before, your husband's telling me, oh, I heard how difficult you are. People tell me you used to be super difficult. <laughs> I'm sure I have been. I, I, even sure I can't I even imagine you like that. I felt that I was being targeted by you and your husband. Sorry, that's how I felt. 
And I stand by that today. This is the first I've heard that. You've mm -hmm. never mentioned that. Leslie from Boca said, Kyle, you said Dorit is like her talkative evil twin after a couple of tequila <laughs> shots. Yet when yes. Camille accused Dorit of drinking too much, you took offense to that. So which is it? After going through what I've gone through with my sister, and I know that when you say something, you put it okay, out there, that could a spark a rumor, situation. and that I don't feel that's the truth. Camille, mm -hmm. uh, Maddie from Elko, Nevada said, the world needs to know if you've consulted Alison Dubois to ask if Dorit <laughs> will close her mouth. I have no contact with Allison, unfortunately. You don't, after, since season one. Unfortunately since or fortunately? <laughs> well, she stopped speaking to you after season oh, one. Oh, she was pissed. You save your stories and you... Now you, you just lost all credibility. All right. All credibility. I can give a shit with you. Oh, that's very profound. I know, I know. Just... Oh, so so much. Much. Oh, Let's go. Come on. I can... I can tell you when she will die and what will happen to her family. I love that about me. <laughs> Why was she pissed at you? I mean, because she... Because she thought that I set her up. How could you set her up? Yeah, but she, she, she didn't want to take responsibility yeah. for her own action. I know, but if she, she was a sidekick, she should have seen it coming. Not <laughs> any <really> good. <laughs> I'd like the ball gag for the clubhouse. You can have it. Can I have it for the clubhouse? Oh, Something Is really nasty next... about that. Oh. I don't know where that's been. Can we oh. pee? We are going to take lunch. I need slippers. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs>